We recently put out a poll to our dedicated YouTube community about their practices concerning ultrasound guided nerve blocks. The feedback was intriguing to say the least. But here's a quick breakdown for you. 55% of our poll takers utilize a probe cover. 13% lean towards tegaderm. 22% bypass the covers altogether, opting to disinfect the probe. Makes you wonder where they find the time, right? In our busy practice, we would be left without ultrasound the whole day if we were to disinfect our probes. And the eyebrowsing 7% believe that infectious protection and covering is not essential at all. I must voice my concerns about the latter group, the hazards related to bloodborne contamination and other potential infections are grave. Remember, there have been reported outbreaks of conditions like Klebsiella pneumonia in the ICUs, which underscore the importance of ensuring that both the probe or transducer and its cable are properly protected because the contamination occurs from the cable in the ICU where the Klebsiella outbreak occurred. The American Institute of Ultrasound and Medicine, AIUM, is unwavering in its emphasis of infections control for safe ultrasound usage. Their advice? Always envelop your ultrasound transducer with a sterile single-use cover because the unfortunate reality is that the blood contamination of the probe and its cable happens more often than one might assume and can easily transfer it from equipment to equipment or patient to patient. While infections related to nerve blocks might be uncommon, and particularly it may be very difficult to trace to the source, not utilizing probe covers in ultrasound-guided blocks can be an indefensible stance in a courtroom scenario should a patient contract an infection. Therefore, you simply don't have an excuse of not using a probe cover whenever you are doing a procedure where the needle violates the skin integrity, such as with nerve blocks. An interesting tidbit from our recent NYSORA workshop, many practitioners favor Tegaderm due to its easy application and removal. However, our in-depth race video comparing Tegaderm and two probe covers found that the probe covers are faster. Let me not forget to thank MedExpress Pro for supporting our channel. MedExpress Pro manufactures Easy Cover, which is what we at Nasura use in daily practice for ultrasound guided procedures to protect patients. And although using probe covers adds an extra step and a few seconds to the ultrasound guided procedure, these covers are made from a second skin like soft material and are joy to apply and remove. The Easy Cover enhances our experience further with their engaging designs, such as a stop sign as a reminder to perform the stop before you block a checklist, or the helpful markings like hand here, probe here, pull here. They reduce the likelihood of errors during the application, which everyone also in our practice uses creatively for fun, well beyond strictly professional applications. So that's our take on Easy Cover and why it is a game changer in our practice. And if this video provided some fun or educational value to you, do hit that thumbs up button. And if you haven't subscribed to Nysora's YouTube channel, do it now and never miss the future videos. Until next time.